Hey guys, M. Osborne here with a new video for today. Now by the time this uploads, it will be my one year anniversary of Let's Playing. And this video, I wasn't really planning on making a video for this, but this video doesn't give me an excuse to tell a little bit about myself and to thank who I want to thank. So, yeah, I'm going to make this video brief, as brief as I can. So a little bit about myself. I started making Let's Plays on March 7th of 2012, I think. Even though I did make my channel on February 4th, I don't... I, the, I think I got my channel on February because I wanted to take the name M. Osborne because I, want, I wanted to see if the name was already taken because I really wanted the name and if it, if it was taken I would have been sad and if it and when I when I went to check to see if it was taken it wasn't and I was glad and so I clicked to create a, an account to make sure that nobody was going to get it for, for some reason I don't know why because I don't know my friends made up the nickname M. Osborne they just randomly started calling me M. Osborne I don't know why but they have now my let's plays uh my fr the first let's play I started doing was Super Mario 64 but I stopped doing that because I don't know well because this it's like the most abundant let's play in the world and for beginner let's plays to start off with so the so I just kind of quit on it but my videos are still up there the first video I did was very very bad uh, the second video the voice was very bad the third and fourth episodes, I was with my friend, and he was very annoying, so... <laughs> yeah, go watch that if you want to just bore, bore your head to death, I don't know. Now, the second Let's Play I did, it was Kaizo Mario World. Now, this that's a ROM hack made by Japanese people, I think. And I played it because it looked really hard, and I loved to challenge myself. And it was fun. It was really hard, but fun. Go get that game. If you have an emulator, please go play it. It's really fun, actually. <laughs> I actually am making a ROM hack myself with Lunar Magic. I'm giving it to people to test out, but I've been kind of putting off that. Anyway, my third Let's Play. Paper Mario for the N64. I did that game because... It's... A game... Like, okay, I, start, I started this Let's Play... The... The day, I think, after we recorded the Super Mario 64 Elimination. I'm sorry if you hear, like, a noise going on. My Skype's going off. I should really put that offline, but... Um... It was... We did it after... We recorded... Super Mario 64 Elimination. If you don't know what that is, it's a video made by... Concave Jelly, who actually messaged me in my personal YouTube account. But anyway, off topic. Um, I recorded the first episode with Sam's 100, and I, I don't know why, I just felt like I needed a guest, because just so it could be less awkward for the rest of my recording. And it's a very fun game, I had a good time with it actually. It was a really, it was a really good feeling finishing that Let's Play too. That's cool. Now, that's like the first Let's Play I actually finished, because I'm not the best Let's Play in the world. But, the Let's Play I did after that was... Or it's still going on as of, as of this point. Sly 2 Band of Thieves. As of this point in recording, only five episodes have gone up. The reason I haven't been recording much because my disc is really scratched up, and it's really hard to play on a scratched disc. The cutscenes will barely even play. So that happened. Now the let's play that's currently going on right now, and I'm still recording. The videos are still rendered. Is Pokemon Emerald Blind? I did that game because I heard Pokemon is really good, but I, I, I did play Pokemon as a kid, but I don't I remember like nothing of it. Like absolutely zero. Maybe like half or one or two, but <laughs> anyway. I'm I don't but I don't think I played Emerald in all my life. So I played that and I heard it was moderately difficult. So yeah. I did that. So those are all my let's plays. Now about me. 
Small little t detail I just want to tell myself. I actually live in Illinois. A little tiny c town called Fairmount. If you know if you know where that is, come see me because I want to meet you. <laughs> and yeah, Illinois is like the what top three worst states. Go look it up on Google because I guarantee you it's like one of the top three worst states because of Chicago, and I hate Chicago. Actually, no, I don't hate it, but I just hate the people that live there. It, they bug me. <laughs> so yeah, uh, about that. Bleh. That's it. Now, with this part of the ooh, sorry, I got distracted. With this part of the video, I want to thank the people that have been with me throughout my Paper Mario Let's Play, and ever since we started Mario 64 Elimination. Now, the first person I want to thank is one of my very, very good friends. His name is the Gaming Guru 51, or Jamie. The reason I want him to thank him first because he has been like my best friend ever, and I freaking love you, dude. You are just freaking awesome. We talk on Skype like every single day, and you're just awesome. You're just an amazing person to talk to. You like we talk about video games all the time, and we talk about just random stuff and we make we have good times together so I thank you so much for being there for me all the time thank you anyway the second person I want to thank is noobkiller740 or Bryant he's another good friend that I talk to but I don't talk to him on a regular basis for some reason I really should because he's a really cool guy he's currently doing a let's play also I haven't mentioned Jamie the Game Group 51 is actually doing a blind let's play of Majora's Mask, which is awesome. I love that game to death. And it's a very hard game too, and actually, he's actually doing a pretty decent job. And uh, Bryant, if I have mentioned his name, his name is Bryant, and he's doing a let's play of Pokemon Fire Red, which I cannot watch because I'm going to do every single Pokemon game blind. It will happen. But yeah, we have such good times together on Skype. We do talk to Skype. He, uh, he is funny. I can't really explain why he is, because nothing really comes to the top of my head. But we have come up with great stories, dude. I freaking love you to death, too. Hugs. Air hug. Yay. But I don't. He lives so far away from me, I can't hug him. <laughs> yes. So That's it. I'm another person. Who can I pick? Oh yeah, I'm going to thank. Concave Jelly. The excuse me, voice cracked. The reason I want to thank him is because he's the one that put together Mario 64 Elimination together, and that game is really fun, actually. As at this point, we've only recorded th uh, th three episodes. And I can't believe I'm actually still in it. It's really weird. I should not be in it because I'm not that good at the game. But, um, Oscar. Cocky Jelly. His name is Oscar. I'm thanking him because he put the, the, the whole Mario 64 together. And he's the reason I actually met all of my friends. Oscar never actually gets on Skype. He never actually uploads a whole lot either, but dude, you are just the best guy ever. Air hug too. Air hug too. Air hug Jamie too. I'm afraid I didn't air hug you earlier either. I'm actually waving my arms. I don't know why. <laughs> and one person that is like the smartest guy. He's like so intelligent. His name is Neo Doc Ray TV or Ralph. He is freaking smart. I don't talk to him a whole lot, but I... He is smart. He, he told me the whole Zelda timeline. Which is cool. Like, I don't even know of a person who, actually, who can actually tell the whole Zelda timeline. But he's the guy if you want to go... If you want to, bleh, go learn from him. Again, he doesn't. He never goes to Skype. I never talked to him a whole lot, but yeah, he is a guy. All right. Uh, 
And a few people that I never actually talked to but are actually in the competition is Salmon's 100, the Goomba Juker, which he actually never he never actually gets on Skype or he I don't I don't think we even think his channel is even on anymore, which is a weird. Can't believe that actually. And Jacob one zero two nine. I don't. There's no particular reason I want to thank them, because I just wanted to mention them. So yeah, I think that about wraps it up. So yeah, thank you guys so much. All of them inspired me to become a better let's player and to. Be more enthusiastic about my let's plays and I just love you guys all so much you, like you don't even know I actually want to thank everybody who has watched any of my videos and commented it actually makes it makes me it means it means more to me than you might think like it means so freaking much you don't even know Yep, so that's about it for this anniversary. I thank you all so much for watching this. Watching my anniversary, and even watching any of my last plays, even tolerating them one tiny bit. I thank you so much. Thank you to everybody who's actually subscribed to me, anybody who's commented, anybody who's watched my video in the slightest. Thank you so much. I love you all.